What's going on, YouTubers? Heart Collector and Ethan Monster here. Hi. Little man, tell them what today is. It's Friday Free Day. Woo! It's Friday Free Day. Oh, but this is going to be a totally different kind of Friday Free Day. Yeah, we're going to have the giveaway. We have the giveaway, so don't worry, guys. But this is going to be a super special giveaway. What are we going to be answering? A lot of questions that people uh, have been asking. Uh, exactly. A lot of questions. We've been getting tons of fan mail. That's one thing. But I've been getting thousands and thousands of messages from everybody. And I figured this is going to be the best video that can answer all the most important questions. Mm -hmm. So, if you, ask, if you ask me one of these questions and I send you this video link. If you're watching this video, if I sent you this link... The answer to your question is here in this video. So pay super close attention. We had planned on opening fan mail. I'm not kidding. You about to say, how much fan mail do we have? Like a lot. <laughs> Just look at what's over here. So that we're trying to organize it. But, okay, while I was in the middle of that, I just started jotting down ideas because so much was coming to me. Look, I literally wrote it on a napkin. This was not planned at all. None of this was planned. I wrote it on a napkin. We have to get to some important issues. Look at that. Okay. So first thing is fan mail. Yeah. Let's get to the fan mail. Guys, we have hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of fan mail. As you can see, we had it all lined up ready. We're barely, this is the next one in line. 1023. This is October 23rd. So if you sent anything after October 23rd, we're not there yet. Because we went to try to go pick up our fan mail sometime in November. I can't remember when. And they withheld our stuff. The people at the post office do not like us. <laughs> it's because, it's not because of us. It's because so much fan mail gets sent that doesn't have the correct postage. So they have to sort it. When we went there, what did they tell us? They tell us that we need to go pick up the other fan mail later. Yeah, they wouldn't let us pick up our fan mail. They had it withheld. They said they didn't have the manpower to sort it out, weigh it, and find out how much we have to pay. Just to pick up this bundle. This was one bag. Look how much we had to pay. We paid $110 because all this stuff didn't have the correct postage. So we're paying a lot, a lot of money to get the postage. And then to send the stuff back to people, that's why it's just, oh, it's been a, kind of a headache dealing with the post office, not with you guys. But if you guys do send us fan mail, please just try to send the correct postage. Otherwise, it's going to hold up everybody's mail i couldn't collect this mail for like two months or a month and a half something like that so we're so far behind in fan mail but what's more important to the fan mail is the thousands of questions we've been getting huh monster wait uh oh i hear ari <laughs> i think we woke her up see what happens when you do a friday free day early in the morning let me go get ari hold on hold on let me go get ari all right <laughs> i just picked up ari ari what happened you just woke up look at bedhead Ari, <laughs> she just woke up here, Monster. You want to hold her? You want to hold your baby sister? All right, Ari, right, you going to help us? Maybe she woke up because she wanted to help us with Friday Free Day. Whoa, little girl, your hair is messed up. <laughs> Good morning. You want to help us do Friday Free Day? Say Friday Free Day. Say Friday Free Day. Here you go. There you go. <laughs> She's so happy. Friday Free Day. Here, and you can blow this. Use this. You blow on it. Yay! She's part of the crew now! Yay! Friday free day! <laughs> okay, you got her, Monster? Okay, take good care of her. Okay, so a bunch of questions. Okay, number one question. Collabing. We get hundreds and hundreds of requests to do collabs. Not just pack battles, but collabs as in product reviews for companies as well. This is where it gets a little tricky and I need to explain it to you guys. We've had a big name YouTuber. Do you remember that monster? Mm -hmm. We had a huge name YouTuber with over 1 million subscribers offer originally to pay us $1,000 to do a collab with him. Then I told him no. Then he ended up raising the offer all the way to, th guys, listen, $3,000 just to do a pack battle with him and shout him out. That's all he wanted. Here's the catch. His channel has inappropriate content. I went to go check out his channel. He was using language that I would prefer not to use on the channel and doing some stuff that I would not want Ethan to see. So, guys, no amount of money, no matter what, no matter what a company wants to pay us, a big name YouTuber, yeah, that could have gave us a lot of subscribers. His channel, his people coming over could have gave us tons of views, 
but I'm not willing to sacrifice our like the safety of the channel and just the innocence of the channel guys I'm raising a kid of my own I know a lot of parents out there your kids are watching our channel and I totally respect that you guys allow them to which is why we would never compromise that in any way any shape form way nothing you can't pay me a million dollars to make me do something that would be controversial like that so to those companies that I have not responded to I'm gonna send you those, this video so you're gonna know Remember that company that wanted us to do taste testing for them? They wanted to send us a monthly box and they put all kinds of stuff inside and they wanted to pay us money on top of sending us the box. I went to go check out what's inside the box. What was inside there? Like, there is shrimp flavored chips. Well, the shrimp, <laughs> you just didn't like the shrimp. What was the other thing, the concerning one? The... You can say the word, go. Beer flavored Oh, yeah, exactly. Beer flavored chips. Yeah. Guys, I'm not going to do a product review and tell your kids, mmm, this beer tastes good. <laughs> There's no way. No way. I shut that offer down so fast. The worst one was, remember I mentioned it before, the fidget spinner that does what? Light your cigarette. <laughs> Light your cancer stick. And then you can spin your fidget spinner, have fun, and smoke your cigarette and die while you're doing it. Guys, they wanted us to review a fidget spinner that can also light your cigarette. It was a cigarette lighter. I was like, oh my god, are you kidding me? No way am I going to do that on our channel. There's no way. We're raising a baby here. I'm not trying to smoke on the channel and drink burr. There's no way I'm going to do that. <laughs> but guys, you can be more safe and assured. Parents, if you guys are watching this, you can be assured knowing we would never compromise that in any way. We have a ton of YouTubers asking us to do collabs with them i check out their content and i see stuff that's not appropriate i'm not gonna send your children and provide them a link to go click on inappropriate stuff i'm not gonna do it so if i'm not collabing with you or if i'm even ignoring some of your questions it's because your stuff is inappropriate and if you want to you can message me if you don't see why it is and I, I can tell you why but i shouldn't have to you know what you're doing is wrong all right next thing Face reveal. Guys, every day I get like 10 questions. How come you don't show your face? Why don't you show your face? When are you going to show your face? That's actually a legit question. That's a good one. But the why don't you? And it's because, remember Monster? I was born without a head. <laughs> I, don't, I don't have a head. Ethan knows it. Like, do you see a head on me? No. There's no head. My lips is just on my chest. That's it. I was like, <laughs> That's a weird thought. No, it's not that. Guys. I'm a federal officer full-time. This is going to answer it. A federal officer full-time. My name is Andrew Teach. So many, that's another question. What's your real name? What's your real name? People think I keep that a secret, but I don't now. Not anymore. It's Andrew Teach, guys. I'm a federal officer full-time. When I'm on duty, you can bet I'm not using my real name when I'm on duty. I cannot tell you guys what I do, but just know that that's why I can't show my face. When I told them at my job that I was starting a YouTube channel... They told me, do not show your face because we get, trust me, I get all kinds of death threats all the time. So if you even think trolling us is bad, guys, I get death threats for a living. So come on. There's no, nothing you can say in the comments that's going to, oh, he said I mean, what? <laughs> There's no troll that can troll us. I'll just put it to you that way. But guys, that's why if I show my face here and then there's someone that comes looking for me, they're going to make the connection between me and Ethan right now. And that I just can't do that until either my job position changes or if YouTube ends up becoming big enough so that I quit my job and do YouTube full time. How cool would that be? That'd be cool. Can you imagine? Yeah. Ari, I can stay home with you all day. <gasps> Say what? We can do a Friday free day every day. <laughs> but guys, who knows? That's later down the road. There's people that have millions of subscribers and they end up quitting their job. That's a thought that would come way, way later. I'm satisfied where I'm at now. I love my job. I love our hobbies. I love doing YouTube. It's so fun and perfect the way it is. I'm not asking for anything to change. But if it does, I will adapt. All right, next thing. What else? What else? What else? What else? There's a bunch of stuff. Oh, speaking of trolls. No, no, I've got to get this out there. Speaking of trolls, a lot of people comment, why does Ethan get so much stuff? Like the Christmas video. I'm getting tons of questions, even parents. Sometimes parents are a little upset that I show how much stuff Ethan gets. Let me let me do this because 
I need to answer this. A lot of kids are thinking that they're not as good as Ethan. They're not as smart as him. They're not as nice as him. That is not the case. Ethan is not smarter than most of you guys there. He's not nicer than most of you guys. There's probably some of you kids out there that are like perfect angels. That's all I can say. Perfect angels. We are not perfect in any shape or way, but we try to be the best we could be. That's all we ask for. You got to tell them. This is your this is your chance. You tell them why you get all that stuff. Because I want it. I want to review it on the channel. Uh-huh. And I want it shared with the kids. Oh, you want to share the experience in the moment? Yeah. Guys, if you would if you saw our Christmas video, all that stuff, it's still sitting there. Ethan knows that we can wait and do all the reviews. He can either open it all now and not let any kid share in on the experience. Or he knows we can do the video and tons of kids will have fun watching it. Leave comments. Say what their favorite stuff is. Ethan loves to read some of the comments. Guys, there is no way that is being spoiled. When you want to open stuff to share with other kids, most kids would be crying right now that they can't open any of that. Ethan chooses to wait. Huh, little man? And so that's why I allow Ethan to ask for as much stuff as he wants on his Christmas list. Because, to be honest, we're a review channel. We have a review station. We're YouTubers and we need content to provide to you guys. So why not ask for as much as you can, right? What do you have to say? You just want to ask for a clapper? All she wants is a clapper. <laughs> that's on your Christmas list. But guys, that's why Ethan gets so much stuff. Not because he's spoiled. Not because he's better than you. Not because he's nicer than you. It's because, to be honest, he's a YouTuber that wants to share all these experiences with you. There's so many kids out there like Roblox. They will always see Roblox on a shelf. Their parent will never buy them a box and they'll never know what it's like to open it. So Ethan knows that. So he wants to ask for it. He gets to open it, have fun, and then you guys get to share in on the experience. Right, Ari? Right? Right? You want to share the experience of how it is to change a diaper? <laughs> we can do a review on how to change a diaper. Alright guys, so what we're going to do going forward from now on, if there's any important questions that you guys want, Go ahead and ask them in the comments. And then when we do Friday Free Days. Ari, what's your question? What's your important question? What is it? I swear, we're going to catch her first words on video. She wants to open fan mail. <laughs> but guys, if there's any important questions that you want to know, please ask it in the comments. And we'll be choosing those comments later to answer. But, oh, one other thing I had to bring up about the collabs. Remember, Monster, about GameStop and Pokemon? That was another issue. Guys, just in order to get featured on GameStop TV, we had to get approval from the way, way higher ups. And then to allow Carl to even work for GameStop and set up a Pokemon Center, we had, we had what are we? We had to get approval from even higher, higher ups. Everyone in Pokemon watched the videos. Everyone at GameStop had to watch our videos and approve of it. So if we were to collab with any other channels, depending on how if they have content or not that would kind of misrepresent what we stand for we've already signed an agreement it would be misrepresenting gamestop and pokemon as well and we could have to remove all of those videos that we've done for you guys that even mention or show pokemon center in there so guys we have to represent these companies so that's what happens to big youtube channels sometimes you might think oh they're too big for us they don't want to do reviews with us guys that's not the case i love Love doing the poker purge. Remember, little man? The poker purge was so much fun. But now it's like I'm walking on eggshells, guys. I'm like treading on thin ice. I have to be super, super careful. And just collabing with the wrong person could endanger our entire channel. And that's what I want you guys to know. I'm always there to support little channels. You guys can always contact me. There's channels out there that always ask me for advice, tips, help. I will always be there to help out the little channels, smaller channels, bigger channels, little channels, doesn't matter. I will always be there to help because that's the kind of people that we've always been. So if you guys need help, advice, whatever, ask away. Ask away. I don't mind. It might take me a little while to get there to help you out, but I don't mind doing that. And then trust me, we are working on an idea. This is going to be on New Year's. Wait for New Year's. We have a super top secret project, but hopefully the whole collab issue we can kind of fix that in somewhat of an awesome way, I think. And no one's ever done it before. Yep, exactly. Right, Ari? <laughs> but I think it's time to get to the giveaway. Yep. Is there any other questions that I missed? 
Those are the ones that I'm getting every single day, guys. So I wanted to do this video to address all of those issues. All right, you ready to get to the giveaway? So, if, what happened? Nothing. Uh oh, did she go uh, number two in her diaper? Uh oh. <laughs> All right, we got to get to the giveaway, and then we got to get to the diaper. All right, the giveaway. The piles are down here. If you guys remember, there was pile one, two, three. We asked all of you guys to comment. There was over like 3,000 some Guys, you ready for this? We printed out. We used a comment. It's called like a comment scraper. It scrapes down everyone that said the pile they wanted and the number they wanted. Look at all the names. Just look at all the names of everyone. It keeps going and going and going and going and going and going look how many do you guys see your name on there look it just keeps going there's a ton guys it'll take forever we're in the thousands there's still two thousands there's still three thousands it'll take forever to show off every single little name in detail but there you go all right there you go and i gotta be careful showing some of the names because sometimes people have bad words in there and one of our videos got taken down because we're like doing shout outs so i gotta be real careful but all you guys are in here. Everyone that left your pile comment, you're in here. See your number? Everyone has a number that's next to their name. So if you left a comment on that video, your name is in here. You're probably number like, let's see, 1,222 Cooper's World. So look, all of these numbers, you guys are in here. We put every single number inside of this tin. It's our Pikachu raffle tin. You ready, little man? Every single number is inside of there. Look at that. I had to step down on it like three times to squish it in there. All right, so let's mix it. We already mixed it up once. Uh-oh. Should we let Ari choose it? <gasps> okay, it's already mixed up. It's already mixed up. Hold on. We're going to let Ari choose it. It's mixed up, but we got to shake it for good luck. You ready, little man? Okay, here. Shake it up really good. Yeah, shake it. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. Ah, shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake your raffle tin. You want to shake it? Shake it, Ari. Shake it for good luck. Give it good luck. Oh, she's going to eat it. <laughs> okay. No, okay, okay. Oh, she wants it. You can have it after this. Draw the name. You ready? All right, Ari. You ready? <laughs> We're having problems with Ari trying to pick one. Ready? Here. Okay, you got to pick one. There you go. Pick one, Ari. Pick one. This is going to be the winner of the raffle. And... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Pick one. She had this one. This one? You got it out of her hand? Yeah. Okay. This is going to be the winner. You ready? Uh-oh. Where's the blower and the clapper, monster? Oh, she threw it on the ground. Oh, she threw it on the ground. It's okay. All right. Are you ready to start clapping? Here. The winner is number... Good luck to everybody. This was chosen by Ari herself. You ready? Number... Oh, here it is. Number 761. Yeah. Who's number 761? Like Whoa. Way. Wait, hold on, hold on. 761? <laughs> <laughs> or he's grabbing it. 761, guys. Who is it? Who is it? Oh, we got to get to that diaper right now. We got to get to that diaper. Hold on. Oh, next page. 761. Congratulations to... James Bond! James Bond! It's like James Bond! <laughs> Congratulations, James Bond! You, we're gonna go back and check your comment. Congratulations! <laughs> we're gonna check your comment and see which pile you wanted, and then I'll direct message you, and I'm just gonna need your information so I could send all that stuff to you. But congratulations to James Bond! <laughs> Thank you so much, guys, for participating. That was a huge turnout. There was like over 3,000 something uh, messages. Yay! Ari, are you mad that you didn't win? Uh, maybe next time, okay? Maybe next time you could win. <laughs> All right, guys, but make sure you guys leave your questions. If you guys have any important questions that you want to know that you guys are wondering, I'll be more than happy to start answering them on Friday free days like this while we open the mail. But we got a lot of work ahead of us. Guys, go on my Facebook, Andrew Teach, and you'll see all the stuff that we open off camera. I opened up another pile. Okay, okay, Ari, hold on. <laughs> but we we uh, posted it onto my Facebook, so it's on there. All right, so thank you so much, guys. Monster, anything to say? Uh, subscribe, like, comment. Ari, anything to say? Subscribe, like, and comment. And happy Friday, free day. <laughs> 
All right, guys. Thank you so much. We love each and every single one of you. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye. Bye.